standards of insanity defense, a person accused of a crime can acknowledge that he committed the crime. Um, dito naman daw, kung ang isang tao pinakasahan daw na isang krimen ay maaaring kilalanin na na ginawa niya ang isang crime. One, the Magnatian rule, the Daniel Magnatian's case 1843, English court maintained that the man was not responsible for an act if he does not what he is doing, does not know what is right and wrong. Ito naman daw, kung nangindigan daw dito ang English court na ang isang tao ay hindi mananagot para sa isang kailos, hindi niya ginagawa ang mga nagawa at hindi alam kung ano ang tama at mali. The rule created a presumption of sanity as the defense or, or a defense of the grant of insanity to be established or it must be clearly proved that at the time of the committing of the act, the accused was laboring under such an effect of reason from the disease of the mind as the to know the nature and quality of the act he was doing or if he did not know it that he did not know that what he was doing was wrong. Ito naman daw, kung ang isang ito tinig daw ay imigha na isang pagpaglagay ng patimukan maliban kung ang pagkakanggol ay napagdunayan. At kung ang isang pagkakanggol daw sa bagayan ng pagkabalim na itinatag, ito ay dapat na malinaw na patunayan na sa oras ng pagkawa ng kilos na ang akusado ay magawa sa ilalim ng tagmiran na sa sakit ng isip at bilang din ang hindi alam ang kalikasan at kalidad ng kilos na kanyang ginagawa or kung hindi niya alam na mali ang kanyang ginagawa. To the irresistible impulse test, Commonwealth B. Rogers, 1884, it provides accused cannot be guilty by reason of insanity because the mind of the accused was in a disease and a strong state. The disease existed to a high degree which overwhelmed the reason conscious and judgment of the person who acted from an irresistible and a controllable impulse thus consequently the act was not the act of the voluntary agent but the involuntary act of the body without the concurrence of the mind directly in. Um, ito naman now, kapag uh, ako sado ay may sakit sa pag-iisip or wala sa pag-iisip hindi siya mahagulan na guilty dahil uh, ang ginawa niyang kasalanan may hindi minanonggapin pero ang isip ay wala sa ang um, katimuhan. 3. The Durham Rule Monte Durham Case 1953 states that an accused is not criminally responsible if his unlawful act was the product of mental disease or mental defect. Dito naman daw uh, is um, sinasaad na ang um, isang akusado ay walang pananagpukan sa isang krimen kung um, ang kanyang lab labag sa isang patas na gawa ay walang isang sakit sa isip or may mental defect. For Brunner Rule American Law Institute 
para sa criminal na yung isang pagbali ko dari sa oras na nag-gali bilang sulta ng sulit sa isip or may kulansya na ng malaking yung kapasidad yung kapasiti na pahalagahan ang criminality or yung kamalikan ganun ng kanyang pag-gali sa inakailangan ng panas. Determinants behavior. One, hereditary or biological factors. Ang example na lang dito is kanwari yung magulang yung mata niya ay kulay at at uh, may kayo mga ding mga mga mata mo niya ganyan yung yung brown niya blue ito ba ibang mga green uh, is na papas na papas sa kanilang mga jeans para sa kulay ng para sa kulay ng mata ng kanilang mga anak ibig sabihin no hereditary hereditary yung parang may na uh, genetically transmitted or daily but mula sa magulang hanggang sa kanilang mga anak to refers to the genetic yun nga po yung ano refers to the genetic influences those that are explained by heredity the characteristics of a person that is from birth transferred from one generation to another dito po yung ano yung tumutukoy din sa ano genetic na yung na-influensyahan yung or ipinapanawalag sa yung mga pagmamanag at yung mga katangian sa tao na nakukuha mula sa kanilang kapanganakan na init na nailipat mula sa isang inerasyon pagmulo sa isa pa. 3. Environmental factors refers to anything around the person that influences his action, his social, cultural influences. But dito naman daw sa environmental factors, dito natutukoy na sa anumang bagay sa paligid ng tao is ma-influensyahan sa kanyang pag kikilos niya sa kanyang mga at sa na-influential na-influential na cultural influences The following are environmental factors 1. Family It's a big same consideration because it is in the family whereby an individual first experience how to relate and interact with others. The family is said to be cradle of personality development as a result of either a close or harmonious relationship or a pathogenic family structure that disturb family, broken family, separated or just behaviors. And family is also the smallest unit of the society. Dito daw is yung yung isang individual na family yung nakaranas ka nakaranas kung paano makipag-ugnayan na makipag-ugnayan sa iba. At ang pamilya naman daw po ay ang sinasabi ang Yan na pagwalan ng personalidad. At sa panito ay ang pinakamaliit na sa panito ang family daw ay ang um, pinakamaliit na unit ng isang lipunan. A. Photogenic family structure.
nurture those families associated with a high frequency of problems such as the inadequate family characterized by the inability to cope with the ordinary problem of family living. It lacks the resources physical and psychological for meeting the demands of family satisfaction. Dito naman tapo po sa photogenic family structure yung mga family daw na na naubay sa mga magpas na yung mga problem tulad daw na yung the inadequate family o yung hindi sapat na pamilya. Hindi gano'n na kung alatrize na sa kawalan ng kakayahan na makaintiyanan social family, those that spouse and acceptable values as a result of the influence of parents on their children. The parents are covertly and overtly engaged in behavior that violates the standard norm of society. This can seriously damage quality of life because of the fear from crime and long-term effect of harassment and intimidation. This can be developed from being subjected to abuse or neglect during childhood, unstable, violent, or chaotic family. The discordant or disturbed family. <clears throat> Characterized by non-satisfaction of one or both parents from the relationship that may express feeling of frustration. This is usually due to the value differences as common source of conflict and dissatisfaction. So instability and changes also refer to as family disorganization which can impact the youth, which includes stress, anxiety, and other mental disorder or illness. Sense of insanity and loneliness, as well as low self-esteem and stubbornness, which is a means in becoming an antisocial one. The disrupted family, characterized by incompleteness, whether as a result of death, divorce, separation, or some other circumstances. Ito ay pagkakaisa o pagkawatak-watak ng pamilya. Ito ay maaaring sanihin ng mga kalim kadahilan ng halimbawa, kamatayan ng isa sa mga magulang, pangingibang bayan, domestikong karasan, deborsyo, na nagiging dahilan kung bakit ang mga bata ay hindi inaalagaan ng kanilang biological parents.